Today, we're playing Nocturne and Callista with the new Terror Curses. We're using the big new fearsome cards like the Dune Swallower, and with Threshold of the Grey and Death Grasp Cultist, we are able to generate a lot of value from just playing big scary dudes. Nocturne turns into a great win con to close out games when the attack of all enemy units get reduced to zero. This deck was really fun and I had a surprising amount of success with it, so let me know what you think in the comments and happy high rolling. The fearsome weapon feels like it was made for Evelyn, because with Evelyn, you're killing stuff on summon. With this deck, we're either gonna kill our unit with Glimpse or Hate Spike, and that's not gonna happen very often, or we die during combat, and you wanna equip it before combat to make it good. <laughs> uh, Cuker queued into us with the deck we were trying to uh, build, more or less. When's the Raren video? Uh, I haven't contacted Raren yet, but I, I will this week. I'll let you guys know if or when it's coming up. Opponent is coping too. I don't know, man. I've I've lost to this deck before. I think it's a really cool concept. Yeah, I wanna I wanna just play on dying here. Let's see who has the better fearsome. I don't know if Kuker uh, updated their deck. Maybe they added some terror as well. The terror cards are kind of just insanely cool. Well, I did say I wanted to see the world. See the world. Two out of five. We got one more fearsome. So if we play this next turn, attack with Nocturne the turn after, Nocturne will be leveled. Blood letters. I think it's that one. Callista was interesting too, but the thing is, next turn we're almost guaranteed playing Nocturne. So that means that we don't have a play necessarily on the turn afterwards. Uh, the positioning there was off, right? Yeah, it doesn't quite work out now. This is very uh, easy to counterplay. I think I also kind of messed up. Maybe I shouldn't have used mana, just played the butler. But if I let this go, if I let the 4 2 go, there's no way for me to play Nocturne. You gotta hit him. Impact. Ugh. Nightfall is such a pain to activate without Targon. Yeah, you really need that one mana 2 1 that gives you the Dusk Petal Dust. It's a one mana card to activate Nightfall and it gives you a card a spell to activate Nightfall. It's so perfect. Yeah, it's, it's difficult. I, uh, that's why I like this Nidalee deck so much, because you get the ambush spells to activate Nocturne. You, like, transform something, you play Nocturne. It, 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 it feels really smooth. Like... I don't think it's meta or anything, but it's just really clever. Now, what you got? It was Avenging Vestaya. And this is a close game, but we're we're gonna level Nocturne soon. What are they at for Nocturne? They're at two. We're gonna get the big boy. So long, and now peace is just moments away. Kind of annoying. We get a uh, we get our own dying back. Five, nine, year four, thirteen. Oh, hello. 
That levels Nocturne. I think we did well thinking ahead with this Spectre Iron Hound, though, for the turn six. That was really clever. And then we got lucky and got another one. <laughs> that works. We must tell our stories, lest they be forgotten. We will just lose to a harrowing, though. I'm pretty sure. 24. No, if they block here, it's still lethal. Needs to be hate spike. Oh, we got him. Not too bad. Uh, in this matchup, by the way, Kalista is king. Kalista is the best card in this matchup. So that, was, that was not bad. But the opponent didn't draw Nocturne, so it's kind of hard to really judge how how much better, how much worse our deck is. But GG. Mordekaiser aloof is hilarious in Eternal. <laughs> Wait, that is so evil, actually. I kind of want to play it. Hey, so have you seen the Infinite Shackled Gas? I don't believe I have. I've heard of it, but I haven't seen it in action. Give Deathless to a loop and resurrect him? Okay. Uh, no, that's a deck we have to play. That is so extremely evil. <laughs> Any deck to play this patch? I'm so confused on what to do. So the deck I'm uploading to YouTube tomorrow is probably my favorite deck I've played. It is uh, it is Shivana Elder Dragon with Aladdis the Gallant, and it is so insanely fun. Stream ends in 40 minutes. Yeah, I'm, I think it's a bit longer than 40 minutes. Unfortunately, uh, I blue screened and had my stream crash once. So it says we're like over seven hours, but I started 12.15 or something. So there is that. We're actually just uh, leveling Nocturne next turn, huh? Wait, this is, uh, this is nasty, man. Are we just winning? Are we just winning? Wait, they can play a 7 drop? They can play a Ron. Wait, chat. Chat, we're doing it. We're having the fearsome pop off. I haven't seen this in close to a year. I haven't seen this since rotation. But none of these can block. The one thing that always annoyed me about Nocturne is how Nocturne says other allies have fearsome. But you need to play fearsome allies to level them up. So it's like, isn't everything already basically fearsome? Oh. Well, you're just dead, aren't you? Darkness. Wait. Wait, chat. Allow me. We have cooked so hard here! Terror, boys! Uh, that, you know who that one is for? That one's for Fiddlesticks. That one's for my boy Fiddle. I cannot be blocked. I cannot be blocked. The Forsaken Bakai is not... This... No, the Forsaken... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, you know, Undying would have been fearsome too. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> What's actually funny though, is if you have Nocturne leveled, and you get your Undying back from reviving, Nocturne will actually activate and give everything minus one. Uh, it does work that way. That's why I really liked the Kalista Nocturne deck before. Oh, I said it was Nocturne Elise, but it was Nocturne Kalista, because Kalista would revive the miss rates. And if you attack with Kalista and Nocturne at the same time, Kalista's Revive will also give them minus one on attack. Your time will come. I think even if they used Avalanche, they'd be close to death. Because Kalista would be 5, 11, we'd summon a 4. Yeah, they, no, they'd be at 1. If they played Avalanche, they'd be at 1. Because this is too hallowed, Kalista would be at 5. No, Kalista would be leveled, it'd be exact lethal. If they played Avalanche, it was exact lethal. It's 6 plus 6 plus 3. 6, 6, Kalista revives this. Yeah, it's exact lethal. But then again, they wouldn't have a unit, so we might not even have need, needed to use the Terror. I don't know. Uh, I'm just explaining, like, why it was uh, the perfect game. <laughs> GG. We, we GG. No mercy. It is 100% Bloodletters. Bloodletters is also really good for Nocturne to activate the Nightfall. We need Bloodletters. Let's see. Skip. Those are bad. I kind of want Undying, I think. Like, Undying enables so many cards. Undying. Nice. The Dune Swallower is also good now. More champ spells should work okay with Kalista for 10 mana. I mean, it works. I don't think it's good. Stop. 
We, we shall not rest until all betrayers Phantom Butler plus no two drop. Phantom Butler could be pretty good. I kind of like Phantom Butler. Uh, let's just draw some cards first. I think that's fine. More Nocturnes. Just Blaze Core. Take with a Prime Sub. Yeah, the Sacrifice decks right now are actually wildly inconsistent. I will agree with that. Just say no. Huh? <laughs> what was that? That's good. So what do we get back? We get Undying back? I'm not angry about that. That's not great. That is probably like both our champions that they're buffing here. We're on two for Nocturne now. If this thing dies, Kalissa will bring it back and help Nocturne. The Dune it's good if this dies. Alright. So we get two Undyings next turn. I really, really love that new revive animation. It's so smooth. Doom is my instrument. I am not done with you. <laughs> uh, we have Ancient Malediction, so Mordekaiser can't do anything. Wait, this card is sick. Look at this. Okay, so the only change we need to make for next game is the it's the blood letters we need the blood letters for some more fodder to make the deck a little more consistent okay but this is like look we're cooking man look at that minus three that's actually good that actually works out like really really well here now we can do this Wait, we're going so ham here. Use this or die. But like, I, I need to see if we have a good card we can replace for the butler. Maybe it's the one drop, but I think the, the Forsaken Bakai is just really good in these type of decks too. We can use the Terror and then level up Nocturne. Oh, never mind. Tragedy. They are on nine mana. I mean... They still can't... Look, we have two Fearsomes actually, chat. Look. They can't block these. I'm I'm too scared of developing because if they have Mordekaiser's champion spell, we could lose. Sometimes this is lethal. More spells, 10. Oh, I was thinking Ruination mana. You're right, it's 10. Oh my god, you're right. I could have even checked it here. <laughs> Alright, we got it. Yeah, I think that was a, a hard one to come back from for them. But yeah, you're right. Awkward. <laughs> Alright, GG. Okay, let's see if we can make space for Bloodletters and maybe the Butler. For the people that don't know, the the sub-visual, this one right here, was made by Fanboy Enjoyer. Actual magic man when it comes to Photoshop. Insane. And yeah, thank you to you all for getting to the 1000. I will watch the VOD later to see the fun part. Yeah, I mean, there's a clip for the for the pie to the face. <laughs> Just look for that one, I guess. Can I ask what your IRL name is? Robin. Do I have a Robin face? I feel like every time I've said that my name is Robin, people tell me, like, you don't look like a Robin. Whatever the hell that means. It's called Batman. I am literally him. I am Batman. You look like a Robin? Oh, thank you. That's the first time somebody's ever told me that. Wanna hear a song? Oh, think I got a beat. Like the One Piece character? Yeah, the black-haired girl. I, I, I'm only on like... I think I'm on episode like... 50? 
I'm on episode 40 or 50. Something like that. I'm playing this. No, it wouldn't have mattered. But if we had a glimpse, it would have mattered. I think this deck. You called and I answered. I think this deck runs. Stun, Celestial Wonder. What is darkness to the unseen? Oh, baby, a triple. What is the deck? Fearsome. Storm unrelenting. A terror fearsome deck. When are you playing that Blade Dance deck? I will let you guys know. Like I said, for the Blade Dance guide that I'm doing on YouTube, I will make everything prismatic when we start practicing. And also, <laughs> I'm gonna make it like a sweaty Saturday video. Plus, I'll make it a soft scripted video. You shall not assail them. Oh, I should have uh, attacked with this first. Doesn't matter. Sing with me. Don't cry in the video. I'll try. No guarantees though. Yeah, I, I should have put these last. Oh, we're doing pretty well. The Zephyr heralds the squall. <laughs> Thanks on mine. You put the gold up, Lamus. I, I'll be honest, I really did not expect to get to 1000. I was talking to Lady Pickle earlier. I was just telling her, like, there's just, there's no way we even get to 500. And then Yay Tuper, Dragon Master, Choji Boy. People just show up and gift a million subs, man. It's insane. I, I'm, I'm just very grateful. Wait, that's a fearsome locker. That's not fair. Actually, no, it's not. <laughs> Oh, it's not a fearsome blocker. Never mind. Is that good? Wait, I actually think, uh... Chat, hear me out. Hear me out on this one. Boom! I don't need mana! Mana's for losers! <laughs> did I miss the lipstick? Yeah. We did Ionia decks, lipstick, and then pie to the face. Basically in the span of one, two hours. Okay, watch, here we go. This is why, uh... This is why Asian Malediction is sick. Watch this play. Storm unrelenting. What do you bring back? I'm dying? I mean, I guess. <laughs> we cooked so hard with this deck, man. Oh my god, look at that. I really want to draw the 4 at a 3-4, though. Oh, we, oh, this is even better than I'm dying! That's so much better! Cooking, man. We cooked hard! Can't they simply play the curse? They're, they're focused, so no, they can't. They cannot. Oh, that's one blocker. It's two blockers. They need to get rid of one more. Can they? I guess I can remove this. Nine? No, it's still lethal now. Chat. I think... I think we cooked with this one. I think we cooked. That is better than I expected it to be. That's nice. Narnica. So, I think we're also pretty good in this. Like, they don't have fearsome blockers early, right? You will burn rice somehow? I will. I'm not good at cooking. I can cook decks. I cannot cook in real. This is true. Um, Blood letters, I guess. Block this. Cooking abilities and still not video how to build decks. I am very slowly working on deck building guide. But it's uh it's very slow progress, to be honest. What is darkness to the unseen? Oh, this 
got it broken. It's not fair. Uh oh. Oh, you think that's a fearsome locker? Cute. Dog feels so strong. It is. It's insanely strong. Yeah, see, that doesn't really work because it's a 3 3 or a 2 3 now because of Knocker. So we're going to do this, this. And then we're still looking pretty good here. They already got the attack in, though, with the dog, which is unfortunate. Uh, I'd be pretty happy if this dies because we want to get the cultist for the spectral iron hound. So I might even glimpse here. I'm not sure. Like, the double Spectral Iron Hound is not good. Oh, is that good? No, it's not. I mean, it levels Nocturne, I guess. <laughs> Barbara. Cat, Poro, Reptile. If they attack with all three, Nico is at five. Right, you know what? We're going to top deck a Terror, and we're going to win. It's not great. It's not great. Uh, double Iron Hound is just really bad, man. It's just not good. Maybe I should have not attacked with Nocturne. Maybe. <laughs> is this not wrong positioning? Oh. Okay. I still think that's wrong positioning, though, dude. You could have done that here, and then block this with Barbara. So you'd have two lucky finds, no? So now when we play the Spectral Iron Hound, this will proc and give us two cards. I really like this card. Like, I think it's a bit too awkward in how you use it, and you'd rather play a Butler on two than this, but it, it, it just feels really nice to have this, like, set up when you need it. Yeah, so we're on four mana. I don't like I don't forever playing this Iron Hound. <laughs> Croakers and crawlers, I study them all, Lurse. Why are you a 3-2? Yeah, I'm assuming we'll see a Nico. Hopping in. Destined to die. Pretty good. An age of torment is nigh. That's really good, actually. Because this is a Titanic, right? Yeah. Pay. Pay up. The synergy is nice, but I, I'm afraid we got out tempoed slightly here. I can't attack here either. We're at four mana again. Uh, Nico is not. I think this is Nico. I think. Where's my net? Hopping in. It's not. No quarter. Unbroken iron. I withstand you. Um. So if I do this, if I do this, we die to <sighs> three sisters. No quarter. It's not. Worth it. Forgetting is death to an immortal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so they have three fearsome blockers now. Three, you switch the opponent's song, clicking the little arrow on the top left. No, you can't do that for the opponent. <laughs> Only they can do that. <laughs> That'd be a fun way to troll them. They also have five Romantic Crystals. Yeah, I mean, I'm making do, man. I'm doing what I can here. I really don't think I had any other plays. Tremble, he approaches. <laughs> no, we're pretty dead, dude. 
we're pretty dead. I'm not sure. I think the I think the mistake I made this game is attacking with Nocturne. I wanted to have the pressure and force them to block so they didn't get like an easy Nico level up. But I think if we held Nocturne back and sir, like treat him as a win con, we could probably be in a be much better position because they don't really interact that well. Yeah, we're dead here, right? <laughs> yeah, we're dead. Alright, did you? Gnarlings, thank you for gifting five subs to the channel. Thank you, dude. I appreciate it. Thank you. Very kind. A thousand and twenty-nine subs in a single day. Absolutely insane. But I never found Nico. We uh the, the double Dune Hound or the double Iron Hound was killer. We couldn't use them because we had to keep nuking our mana. Okay, again. This time, no avalanche, surely. Okay, good curve. Good curve. What are your thoughts on the Haitian nerf? Uh, yeah, they nuked the card. And honestly, good. Great, even. Deserved. Can you try making a Master Yi flow deck with Elder Dragon boons anytime? That actually does sound pretty interesting. I haven't thought about uh, flow synergy with the boons. I might cook that. Hey, Sunny, I concede the game. Why? You don't have to. Just don't look at the stream. No, we're good. We're friends. I'm test Mord Evelyn, and it feels great. That's another deck. I need to try that deck too, because the Evelyn skin is a banger. Um, that Evelyn skin, whew. The fact that she gets a different husk skin for all of them is insane. Because I look, it's fine, man. Just play. Just stop looking at the screen, and let's play. It's all good. I, uh, I'm not, I'm not in a try hard mood. I'm not trying to climb. If you want to play against me and have, uh, have a good time. Let's do it. Let's get it. So you got a new skin for every single husk gets a new skin, yeah. Don't worry about it. Fair warning? Yeah. It's all good. And I just have to soul fighter without skins? Is that one isn't I don't know if it's less expensive. I don't, I don't know the pricing. I just buy it regardless of the price on the skins. I'm a, I don't want to say I'm a whale, but I am a large fish. Yeah. <laughs> I hope that explains it, guys. It was a pass skin? Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Very good. Alright, so far so good. Okay, I mean, that means they don't ramp, right? So that's also fine. You may know him as a the whale. I, I am not a the whale, but I am one of many whales. For sure. Don't say that word. Now they will put a $200 skin in other war for whale for whales. That It took them like 10 years to do that, though, for the other one, right? I don't know. I'm not that worried. Oh, wow. Miguel Mlaker. Thank you for the seven months. Thank you, dude. Uh, my sequencing was off there, actually. I shouldn't have done that that way. I had no. I, I shouldn't have glimpsed that. I was thinking about doing the um, the black spear, but that wasn't correct. That was incorrect. Yeah, that was bad. That wasn't good. I shouldn't have done that that way. All right. <laughs> These are too big. I don't think I can beat this anymore. 
My sequencing is very off this game. It's not good. Mm. Still find a way to win. This is where I wish that Zolani was Titanic. All three of them, but that's like the best card in the game, dude. What the hell? We have waited so long, Zolani. And now peace is just moments away. So now Horse Winds is a very scary card. Let's see if this is enough. He threw him? I don't think it's throwing. Like, I think you're just supposed to play those cards. Mm -hmm. That's a heal? I am free. Freeze? Alright, GG. Ah, I, I missed sequence there. I changed my mind on the Black Spear in the last second because the boon goes on the stack, so I couldn't deal with it anymore. And that was not good. That's I, I shouldn't have done that that way. GG. Thanks for, uh, thanks for the fair play, though. Even after announcing it on the stream. Anyway, if anyone has a suggestion for another sub goal, I'm all ears. But I'm also I'm also gonna be here tomorrow for the stream with Lobster. We're gonna do a charity stream, which I'm very excited about. We demand another four. I don't think I have it in me. I don't think I do. I'm, I'm not gonna be very fun to be around for another four hours. Eleven on ourselves. Dragon Master gets coaching. If Dragon Master wants to be coached, we can we can make that happen. I don't think I can coach the Dragon Master himself on something like a Dragon deck, though. Lots of good food. I had I had good food. I had I'm a Trishiana. I'm a Trichina. I'm a Trishiana. Pasta. It was, it was very good. I would need to be coached in Lurk. You gotta ask Lady Pickle for that one. She's the expert. <laughs> the journey to mastery begins with humility. You know, Divine Graft is, is really good against our deck. I'm glad like no other deck plays it. That'd be a problem. Coin buys drinker news. I've got both. Okay, that's a fearsome blocker, but hopefully not for long. That's really good. When will you play Aesol Elder Dragon? Soon. Soon. That is a deck I really do want to play. What emotes the chat choose? I'm going to make a Google Sheet, a Google Form, whatever, where you can give your suggestions, and I'll put it up. So people can give suggestions for what kind of emote they want, something Ring Terra themed, and then I will commission them. We can go over the best suggestion on stream, see what people like, and go from there. Okay, if they play set next turn, we have a good counter. That is such a risky play. But they are rewarded for it. Are you gonna cosplay during charity stream? No, I still need to order the stuff that I need. I'm really surprised that uh, our opponent's playing stuff like Divine Draft and Rock Barrage. That just seems kind of terrible into an Elder Dragon meta. Maybe that's just me. Where are your fearsome blockers, dude? You ever confuse confuse set with Z? Not really. I think Germans do that. The German accent. But personally, no, I haven't. The thing is, we're not really killing them anytime soon. Oh, love it. 
<laughs> yeah, screw it, man. Get in my belly. How exhausted are you? I'm not super exhausted, but I can kind of feel it in my in my mouth that I've been talking a lot. I don't I don't usually talk like that much. I'm a silent boy and all. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just starting to feel it that I have been talking a lot. Wow, the they actually had all the answers. I did my best. We are looking pretty bad. Seraphine is at seven. That seems like it's just a loss. Right. Now this will die to a Mystic Shot or high note. This is the matchup where the Ancient Malediction is just not very good. If these were units, we could just spam the board, I think. Yeah, it's a problem that we dealt uh, exactly zero damage to them last turn, so we can probably just fold here. Ain't no fight I can't win. Beat losers, get paid. You, me, in the ring. Interesting place from opponent there. The Seraphine brain got him. This is a unique spell for uh, for Seraphine though. It's not gonna be lethal. But I should probably just attack anyway here. Time to give him a show. Knocked her for the win next attack. I don't think we're gonna get a next attack. Because it's a Seraphine deck and they have a set on the board. Oh, I shouldn't have put this left. Oops, it should have been Seraphine. Yeah, exactly. I don't think there will be a next attack. It's done. What? Okay. Thanks. Yes. We dealt zero damage again though, which is just wild. <laughs> no holds ball. I saw you looking at me. I saw you looking at me. One coin. There can be no justice. Only revenge. I don't know what Nocturne does here, because we don't get set to like low enough. Is that permanent? Grant that enemy vulnerable. It is permanent. I I don't know how we're winning this or how we're even in spot here when we dealt zero damage so many times. That's a lot of power. They have three cards. What you got for me, Seraphine? Nothing. Nothing, even after all that nonsense, we still put him in the grave with our Pearson. Good. Very good. Windows. 